Welcome to Cognition Chunks. This information is for entertainment only. I am not trained in philosophy. Is this useful? Is this nonsense? Join me as I attempt to learn from GPT. Here is Eureka Epics Understanding the Origins of Philosophy by GPT Part 4 Philosophy in Transition Chapter 12 Eastern Philosophies in the Modern Era Section C The Modern Development of Confucianism and Taoism the modern development of Confucianism and Taoism reflects the dynamic interplay between traditional philosophies and contemporary challenges, leading to various reformulations, reinterpretations, and applications in the face of modernity, globalization, and changing social and political landscapes. Modern Confucianism Early 20th Century Reforms The early 20th century witnessed significant challenges to Confucianism in China, especially with the New Culture Movement which criticized Confucian traditions as feudal and impediments to China's modernization. This period saw efforts to either reform Confucianism to align with modern values or to abandon it in favor of Western ideologies. New Confucianism Emerging in the mid-20th century, New Confucianism sought to reconcile Confucian philosophy with contemporary issues. Philosophers like Xiong Shirley, Mao Zongsan, and Tu Weiming emphasized moral self-cultivation, the relevance of Confucian ethics to modern society, and the dialogue between Confucian thought and Western philosophy. Confucian Revival The late 20th and early 21st centuries have seen a Confucian revival, particularly in China, where Confucianism is being reappropriated as part of national identity and cultural heritage. This revival includes the promotion of Confucian values in education, the establishment of Confucius Institutes worldwide, and the incorporation of Confucian principles in governance and corporate ethics. Modern Taoism Philosophical Taoism The philosophical aspects of Taoism, particularly the teachings of the Tao Te Ching and Zhuangzi, have garnered international interest, influencing modern spiritual and ecological movements. The emphasis on harmony with nature, simplicity, and spontaneity resonates with contemporary concerns about sustainability and well-being. Religious Taoism Religious Taoism continues to be practiced in China and Taiwan, adapting to modern contexts while preserving ritual traditions, temple worship, and community festivals. Modern developments include the incorporation of Taoist principles in health and wellness practices, such as Tai Chi and Qigong, and the exploration of Taoist concepts in psychology and alternative medicine. Global Influence The global spread of Taoist philosophy and practices, facilitated by translations of Taoist texts, and the popularity of Taoist-inspired martial arts and meditation has led to a broader, often eclectic, engagement with Taoist ideas in the West. Challenges and Innovations Cultural and Political Contexts Both Confucianism and Taoism face challenges related to their roles in contemporary societies, including debates over their relevance, the risk of politicization or commodification, and the need to address issues such as gender equality, human rights, and environmental crisis. Interfaith and Intercultural Dialogue These traditions participate in global philosophical and religious dialogues, contributing Asian perspectives to ethical, spiritual, and ecological discussions and learning from other traditions. Conclusion The modern development of Confucianism and Taoism illustrates the vitality and resilience of these ancient philosophies in the modern era. By engaging with contemporary issues and dialogues, these traditions continue to evolve, offering insights into ethics, governance, human-nature relations, and personal well-being, while facing the challenges of maintaining relevance and integrity in a rapidly changing world. Thank you for joining us for another Cognition Chunks. Please like and subscribe.